Hey guys, um, I'm actually putting a video, like, as you're about to watch this actual video of my how to install, I am so sorry for the lag, my computer is just out of whack, I am so sorry, I am so sorry for that, please forgive me about that, I, am, I will try to do a better video of that one where you actually see the mod menu and actually action. But that's just a video on how to get it to um on thank you for watching this video um please hit that like and leave a comment i am so sorry again um i will i don't know what to do about that um yes it's gonna be very laggy uh so leave a comment down below on how i can fix this all right thank you guys and Please try to enjoy the video. I couldn't even sit through it. It was lagging too much. Anyways, guys, thank you and peace out. Enjoy the video. What's up, guys? Game Minds here, and today we are going to be playing Black Ops 2. But wait, no, we're not. I'm showing you how to do a how to. Holy moly, guys, this is a how to. How to install your very own mod menu Jiggly V4.3. The Jiggly mod menu? Wait, gamer, how'd you find that? Well, you may be asking. I found it. And I downloaded it. And now I'm going to use it for you guys. But I uninstall it to re-download it for you guys. So you guys can watch me how to do it and how to set it up. And it's only for PC. Not for Xbox unless you have um, an RGH or JTAG. Which I don't have at the moment. Anyways guys, thank you so much. Leave a like, leave a comment. And let's get into the video. Alright, let's do this. Now, I'm sorry if I sound a little eager. Me. The first link is going to be right here. And when this pops up, just... Well, don't wait until it. Just exit. You never know what might pop up on that. Now, as your menu is installing, just wait a couple minutes. You know, chat. Listen to some music. Or whatever you do. I, don't, I really don't know what you do. Also... Uh, <clears throat> I am not responsible for you getting banned or that. Yeah, not responsible. But if you do get banned, I am so sorry. But if you go online, this is your choice. I'm not saying you should. You're I rather I recommend not going online. I recommend just playing a private match with your friends to show them how I got a mob menu. Cool. You show them how to do it. Link, uh, give them to the, um, show them to this YouTube. I'm not gonna be skipping anything. Um, yeah. Sorry if I sound a little eager and everything. I just I did this like four to five times already. So what you want to do is after that's done downloading, you want to go ahead and go to this other website that I'm gonna leave in the description down below. Uh, it's called Black Ops Two. GS GSC Studio is going to help you inject the mod menu into your game so you can play it and it'd be cool. I'm going to show you um, the game without the mod menu and the game with the mod menu so you know that I'm not lying to you or pulling your leg or trying to hit you or something like that. I'm, I'm going to show you the, the exact way how to do it. So I'm just going to let it load and let it do its thing. Let's go ahead and actually op open up um, your thing. There it is. Oh, and sometimes they'll leave a link and it so you can actually download it where you don't have to go to the website. But if you want and you want an easy path, just go to the website right here. But you don't have to do that if you don't, guys don't want to. I'm not saying you should, but yeah. I mean, this link was, this, this, this website was really hard to find. It's like deep web crap there. 
not really, but it was actually, I had to search up on how to get to that website, and finally found it. So, after that, you just want to drag, you see the Jiggly 4.3? What you want to do is just drag it to your uh, downloads folder. It is to help it. Go ahead and exit out of that. Go ahead and open up uh, your lovely GS Studio. Click yes. Exit out your browser. Click it. Language you have or do. Hit that. Hit next. Continue until it's downloading. What a few seconds, it shouldn't be long. Okay. Simple, simple. Now, for the hard part for me is actually recording this because my game likes to freeze. Okay. So here it is. What you want to do is want to minimize that. Go ahead and open this. Get your game to play. I'm going to help you guys see a little more. Hold on, give me a minute, guys. Let me work my little editing magic here. Wait. Did it work? Oh, there it is. Here you go. Now you can see it a lot better than I can. As I have the mini one. Okay. So now, what you want to do is go to custom games, go to custom games first and just see, like, I, of course, you don't have no mob video, but I'm going to show you that I don't have it, so, like, I'm not the one that's faking or anything. Also, if you hear a big, loud, weird sound, my game likes to crash, like it's trying to do right now. I'm hoping it's not, and it did because it's mean okay it happens a lot don't worry guys just give it a minute it's gonna reload uh, why do you do this to me okay as it reloads for me it, it happens it's really stressful Ugh. as it's loading and it's getting its flaws back slowly and painfully <sighs> but yeah so let's go ahead and start game just start game instantly start the game as you can see I'm level 3 because I don't play this much because it lags a lot but I'm showing you that you can actually have the mod menu for PC you can actually inject it it's not like infections like on 360 they finally fixed that for some reason I guess a lot of people started complaining a lot. I understand. I mean, I had a lot of people um, banning people offline and stupid stuff and really getting aggravated with people using infections. But yeah, that's, that's not my place to talk. Okay, so guys, I'm going to aim a knife. You see, usually when you have mod menu, you can move. You can hear my controller. I'm not actually moving. Now I'm moving. Uh, sorry for the uh, low frame rates. Can I actually turn that down? Uh, everything's down. How's the graphics? Yeah, the graphics are all fine. I just got 9%. Holy crap. Okay, so as you can tell, I do not have the mod menu. At all. No mod menu. Nada. Oh. And it's also a lot harder to play. I'm, I'm really bet. I'm actually really... I'm better on 360 than I am on uh, PC. Let's go ahead and shoot some of these mannequins. Let's go ahead and rapid fire this. Yeah, he's. I think he's dead, guys. I think. I think. I think Don is dead. Now he's dead. 
Okay, no mob menu. See? Now, let's leave Mr. Game open. Uh, okay, and uh, sh quickly just shrink you over there. Quickly move you out of the way where you guys can see it. Make sure I'm not doing any funny business. Now, for the fun part, what you want to do is you want to go to connections, go to your PC, hit attach the current Steam process, Steam to Steam. It will, it will say process attached with success. Go to editor, create project, name it whatever the heck you want, which I'm going to name mine. I'm going to say Modder's Life. Yeah. Then it's going to create that. Then once you go back, you want to go that. Okay, hold on. I'm not being very... Hold on, guys. Hold on. What you want to go is back to editor. Go all the way down to inject a com... Ugh. can't read that. It will say this. Sorry. It's just really hard. Oh, shoot. You can't see it. It will uh, say this right here. So what you do is you go... Boo -da -boo -da -boo, like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. You go 10 down. Not 11. 10. Right here. Right there. Then you click. You open this. You go to downloads or whatever the heck you put your little file at. And it'll say Jiggy Point 4.3. Select it. Inject list. And it'll say done. Now. Let's go ahead and reopen this. Let's go ahead and hit back. Let's aim. See, you still don't have it. That's okay. Just exit. Let the mod get. Let the mod go through the codes of. Let the let yeah. Let it go through the codes of Black Ops Three, Black Ops Two. I mean, sorry, Black Ops Two. Let it let it let it do its little thing. Let it get. Let it get its thing. After that, click again. Uh, please work, please work, please work, please work, because you always crash. Sometimes it crashes, sometimes it doesn't. That's because it's my uh, um, OBS. Or maybe I have the wrong file, because I was actually originally trying to do uh, Jiggy 4.4, but it wouldn't work, and I think this one's going to also crash, because it's on, uh, yeah... I, just, I can read this to you right now, what OBS is saying. Encoding overload. Consider turning down video settings or using a faster encoder present. I do do that, and I have done it. It doesn't help. So, if it stops right here, I have a backup. Oh, it's at 3 per frames per second. I really should set... Black Ops 2 for main priority. Like, but, like, high priority. I'm thinking about doing that. Oh, come on. Guys, keep your fingers crossed, because I'm really hoping this works. But first, I'm going to do a little bit of this. Two frames. Dang it, man. Dropping frames like a biscuit. Huh, dropping frames like a biscuit. That that makes no sense, but okay. All right. Let's go ahead and make Black Ops Two our main priority. You guys don't have to do this because you guys probably have a really good computer. I don't have a very good computer. As right now, it's really trying. Where's Black Ops 2? 
That's Black Ops 2. What are you doing down there? Let me set you up. To high. Yeah, you need to be high. Huh. Nah. There you go, guys. I think I fixed it a little bit. Alright, it's a lot easier. Okay, now I can move. So now, guys, get ready. There it is, right there. I have the mob menu. Sorry about that. You can't, guys can't see the, uh, it is, I have a very small screen, so. As you can tell, you can do that. Uh, go invisible, have evac on, wall hack. Um, heck, you can even unlock achievements. There you go. After that, you can go to messages or aimbot. The heck was that? Oh, it was a sound. As it's gonna, like, it's trying, guys. I'm sorry. I'm on five. I'm on four. I'm on three. I'm on, okay. It's going back up. But yeah. <laughs> it's going to crash my computer. Yep. Ooh, the frames are dropping. I'm hoping... I know it's going to be really laggy for you guys, because it's really laggy for me. Let's go... Shoot, man. Change the sky color. Oh, yeah. Can't look up now. Uh, menu settings. It doesn't. Okay, so if I record with uh, OBS to my uh, computer, it really messes people up. I can freeze. I can. You have all your stuff. I can revive. I can send. I can blind player. I uh, get forge. Send to prison. Stuff like that. No, there's a page too. Oh yeah, I'm not level 55. I don't know how to do that yet. Oh shoot. But I honestly hope you liked that little tutorial. Um, yeah, it crashed. It finally crashed. All right. Anyway, anyways, guys, thank you for watching, and I hope you did enjoy this little tutorial. I am so sorry that my computer is stupid and OBS is being a butt. Um, but then again, I do hope you do enjoy. This is a really cool thing to have. It really does help. It really does help. Um, thank you so much, guys. Um, yeah. Um, thank you, and I will see you in the next video. Um, stay strong, Gamer Army. Gamer Army, stay strong.